Is your Telegram app crashing, freezing, or just not responding at all? This video is going to show you a couple of solutions to this problem, so just follow my steps. The first thing which we're going to do on our iPhone or our Android device is to go over to our settings, locate the general section, and open it. After that, I'm going to open this software update page. And what you'll want to do is to check if you have the latest iOS or the latest Android update installed on your device. So maybe the Telegram version isn't compatible with your software version and that's why it's crashing. So updating your phone can fix your problem. After we check our software, it's time to open our Google Play or App Store and then open our Telegram app in here. If you see a little update button, tap that and then wait a minute or two until your Telegram app version updates to the latest version. Updating the Telegram app on your iPhone or Android installs the latest fixes and improvements made by the developers. This can help solve problems like crashes, freezing, or the app not responding by removing bugs and improving overall performance. It's one of the simplest ways to keep the app running smoothly. So you can open the app and check if it runs smoothly and without problems. Solution number three, which I have for you, is to offload the app in your app settings. And we're gonna do that by opening the settings page on our phone, hop over to general, and then iPhone storage. Now, if you're using an Android phone, you might be wondering how to offload an app like you can on an iPhone. Well, Android doesn't have a direct offload feature, but you can do something similar by clearing the app's cache or data. To do this, just go to Settings, tap on Apps, Find Telegram, then go into Storage and Cache. From there, you can clear the cache to remove temporary files without affecting your chats. Or if the app is really acting up, you can choose Clear Storage or Clear Data which resets the app but doesn't delete your Telegram account. Everything is backed up in the cloud. So I'm on my iPhone, and let's continue to the next step. The iPhone storage is gonna open a list of different apps which I have installed on my device, and our job is to find Telegram since we're having problems with it. You're gonna see this offload app option. So just tap here and then wait a couple of seconds. Offloading removes the app itself from your device, but it keeps all of your data, like your chats, photos, and settings safely stored on your phone and in the Telegram cloud. Once you've offloaded the app, just tap Reinstall App. This downloads a fresh version of Telegram from the App Store, and when it opens, everything is right where you left it, and it will give your app a fresh new start. Tell me in the comments if this step solved your issue. The fourth fix is to simply restart your Android phone or your iPhone. I'm gonna open the Control Center, then long press on this little power off button in the top right corner, and then slide to power off. Wait 10 or 15 seconds, and then click the power button on your phone, and wait until it turns on. And the last solution which I have for you is to check if your internet connection is fast and stable. If you're currently using your mobile data, then try to disable that and find a fast and stable Wi-Fi connection. Or if you're already using Wi-Fi, try turning it off, enable your mobile data, and then restart Telegram. The app can have problems when it doesn't have a fast internet connection, so check that. You can check the speed of your internet by opening the web browser, then open a website called speedtest.net, and then hit go. The website is going to measure your internet speed and tell you if it's fast and stable. If you have a 5 megabyte download speed or higher, then the connection is good and that's not the problem. Tell me in the comments if you have another fix for the Telegram app when it's crashing or it's not working. And I will see you in the next video.